muerto el perro, se acabó la rabia. Welcome to El Agujero. Try anything and I'll cut your head off and use it as a football. Nice to meet you too. My name's Danny. Alfredo. Down the stairs. I need six volunteers. I'll talk to my people, honey. Be Jorge and Anna's gangs are probably on the ship. You're Elena? Yeah, the... Danny, right? Where's my medicine? You mean Libertas meds? I gave them to the legends. No. You handed it to some retirees shitting their diapers on top of a mountain. What could you possibly want from them? We need more than bullets and guerrillas to take down Castillo. Like it or not, Yaranos love the legends. Clara Garcia loves her politics. Good luck getting those abuelos off their asses. We could use Lamarado's help. You know why Clara never told you about us? Because to her, we're just a bunch of kids playing with guns. She loves to talk about the future. What is her future, not ours? Clara's just a Castillo who lost his dick. So you have a better plan for Yara? Bullets first, politics later. You said you needed volunteers. Admiral Benitez got the jump on us a couple of hours ago. She's holding my people hostage on a cargo ship. I'll go. Alone? I don't get it. Consider us even for the meds. Save my people, then I'll think about it. Mm-hmm. For real? Libertad? No shit. You saving our people, right? That's the plan. I know a farmer with a helicopter who can fly you out to the ship. Follow me. Take old Irasol. Be nice to him. Smart dog. Andando. <laughs> Be nice, horse. Whoa! You're with Libertad? I am. I think it would be great if we joined forces. Yeah? We've been fighting and we've been winning. But Admiral Benitez will always have more than we do. We kill one soldado today. Tomorrow they get replaced with three more. Where are you going? So, yeah. And when La Moral people die, there is no one replacing them. Not yet. On top of that, these farmers and the people just trying to survive don't want to fight. We need fresh blood. Real fighters. What about getting the legends to join? We tried. None of those abuelos want to fight. I heard a lot of them even support Castillo. You heard wrong. Well, I don't see any abuelos fighting now. I'm working on it. So, how do these farmers get a helicopter? They built it from the parts of ones we shot down. Bing. These farmers are 100% on our side. The other farmers are not? Some are. Some are with Castillo. You think we can get them on our side? We're gonna need them. Only where we're going to liberate El Este. What's going on? I wasn't done. We're gonna need them. Only where we're going to liberate El Este. Maybe when they hear Libertad is fighting with us, they'll join. Your good propaganda, Danny. Fucking Benitez. Venga acá. Pielena called. You wanna lift to that boat? Let's do this. Get in.
name's Calixto. Danny. I'm going to be careful and stay low. I'll get you as close as I can. Where did you learn how to fly? I did my basic service as a pilot a couple of years ago. I got kicked out for calling the captain a come mierda. <laughs> I was kicked out of the ground forces. Turns out drill sergeants don't like getting punched in the throat. Good to know. I never seen you before. When did you join La Moral? <laughs> Wait. I was told you were with La Moral. I'm doing this rescue as a favor. I'm with Libertad. What can you tell me about La Moral? You know that village? They call it Maldito. That the real name? Yeah. Some Spaniard named it back in 1490, whatever. A couple of months ago, Admiral Benitez decided to make it illegal to go to the water and fish. The people protested. Benitez executed half the town. So what does La Moral do? They tracked and killed every last soldado who did the executing. And I'm not talking about guerrilla ambush jungle shit. I'm talking about following them to their homes and slitting their throats while their families are slept. Assassin shit. These kids are smart, coordinated, and cold-blooded. Sounds like it. military convoys passing through them and report them to La Moral. Seems like they run a tight operation. These kids are on the ball. Yelena is more organized than the military. La Moral got our back. When Admiral Benitez started getting rough with our families, La Moral got rough back. Killed any soldado who dared to step foot on our lands. Pretty soon, they stopped coming. This is great! Gracias, mi amigo! Good luck saving those people! Up near the front of the boat.
They threw some of our they fighters some of in our a container fighters. over the hole. container over the Save hole. them. Save them. Someone's walking on the container. I'm on the ship. I freed as many as I could. Hang tight. I am sending boats and backup. Gracias. This is Admiral Benitez. To the fake Yaran terroristas, I have you right where I want you. At this very minute, military forces are heading to your position. I recommend laying down your weapons and taking one last look at a nation that does not want you. Instead of peacefully serving Yara as outcasts, you will die. Right here. Right now. Yelena. They're waiting for you to clear the air. Can somebody tell those planes to hold still? Reinforcements are on their way, Libertad. Coño. I should have called earlier. The boat should be there any minute. Keep it up.
Elena, it's done. Your people are safe. I heard. We even for the supplies? Fuck yeah. Need me for anything else? I had to talk to Gilberto first. But you'll be hearing from me. You got my number. Gracias. You're not so bad, Annie. But you better keep an eye out. If you weren't on Admiral Benitez's radar already, you are now. Welcome to the real El Este. Coño. I feel like bad shit's gone down here. We were just kids, El Tigre. <laughs> Lorenzo, I took pictures of that place Horon was talking about. You swipe to the left. They look free to you. Yeah. Yeah. This is what Liberta and La Moral are fighting. You can hate us, but at least we're doing something about it. No one deserves this, Lorenzo. This is happening all over Yara. You just can't see it from so high up this mountain. I can't look at this anymore. I didn't vote for Castillo. The war is over. So that was a waste? Just on the end. Shoot the tree. Sara, I've met La Moral. Why didn't you send me to them first? La Moral? Last I heard, they were a small group always on the edge of falling apart. They're doing more fighting than the legends. Okay, but watch your step. La Moral has a bad rep, and I don't want Libertad's name to be dragged down with him. I'll keep my eyes open. Danny, come back to El Agujero. Shit is getting real. We need to rally our people and talk next steps. Dale. You're here! Okay. I thought I'd rather you... Hmm. You might want to do this on the download, Danny. There's a lot of soldiers down there. Paolo, what did you get yourself into? Anyway. 
I'd like to think you're here to see your dear friend Bembe. But we both know you're after Paolo. Where is he? He's supposed to be on a first-class flight to Miami right now. But you sold him out. No, no, no. This was one of life's rare surprises. Soldados were waiting for me, Rojas. So I struck a deal. So that's when you sold him out? I traded for my freedom and kickbacks. But I'm not heartless. I will tell you where they took him. Paolo's in a resort in Barrial. If they've done anything to him, I'm coming for you. Promises, promises. If I were you, I'd hurry, Rojas. Paolo's not in the sea. <laughs> Better watch my step. The camera needs to go. I've been waiting for Paolo. Let's move, Boom Boom! We got them where we want them! Avanzando! Avanzando! Hey! Dale, Boom Boom! Drop the gun. Just a guerrilla I wanted to see. I'd like to think you're here to see your dear friend. They took Paolo to a resort in Barria. been captured. They took him to a fucking resort. A, a resort? W what does that mean? Is Paolo okay? Is it a nice resort? Bicho, I'll call you when I have him, okay? I was not here. Fuck. Huh?
Kuro better be here, or Bembe's a dead man. Love these new phones. They're so thin. No pain is a part of progress. Yeah, I learned that from Castillo. Look at Vivero. It would have gone nowhere if I had created the outcast camps. You know, orphans like you make the best test subjects, along with the poor. Anyone on the fringe of society. At 0.5 cc of PG-240, what you call the poison, it's being pumped into your bloodstream. Doctor's orders. All I have to do is call. Wakey, wakey, Danny. Miss me, motherfuckers? Come on, Karim, you're safe. They're with me now. Mm. Uh, uh, he put something in me. Oh, God! He put something in me! <laughs> Get up to Matias! <laughs> Fucking go! Oh, okay, okay. We meet there. <laughs> Matias! Need your help. Danny, I can't talk right now. I got Paolo on the way with Talia. He was fucking El Doctor! He poisoned me! Need to get it out! Okay. You need to get to my clinic on your own. Take the road north. It's a straight shot to me. Got it, Danny? Danny? A car. Need a car. Won't make it if I walk. Move, Danny. I have to get to Matias. Please take a moment and for science. Tell me how you feel. You're not real. By now, the PG-240 has worked its way past the blood-brain barrier. Shut up! Your neurons are firing randomly as they shut down. Your subconscious is taking over. Shut the fuck up! I have one request. Please leave your body in one piece. The autopsy. Uh, uh, oh, fuck! You don't give a fuck about Libertad or Castillo. You just like shooting guns. Lita! No! This is real! Don't you get it? I never should have been on that boat, Danny. You put me there. We had to leave. Castillo was rounding up everyone. No, Danny. They were coming for you. I should have been with Trada, but I came to the city to say goodbye to you. Uh, how was I supposed to know? You took my place in Libertad. You just left my body rotting on the beach. It should have been you. Uh, I'm sorry! You had to be the lucky one. How does it feel? Uh, no. No, no, no! Way to find us body shot? That was your big American dream? That's a terrible thing. The Zorbel Body Shop has such a better ring to it. Alejo? 
you know what we're funnel system? He screams, pity, fuck you. I was supposed to be drowning in Yankee pussy. You weren't supposed to die. It all happened so fast. I wasn't supposed to die. Is that all you have to say to me then? You left my fucking corpse on that rooftop. They were going to kill us too. Alejo, please. I shouldn't have left her. I shouldn't have left her. It was fucking Bembe. He sold us out. <laughs> no, not like this. Not like this. We were supposed to be together, remember? Danny, what are you doing? Danny! Listen to me, Danny. Drop the knife. Save your steel, Danny. Come back, idiot. Oh, how's Talia? You're both lucky you have the best doctor in Yara. Where's Paolo? Just outside. Said he had a war to plan. Fuck. Now cut yourself open again, and I am not putting you back together. We got a pro. Bitch has gone crazy. Screaming about Bembe. Blaming him for what happened to you, me, and Talia. Last night, he took off while we were sleeping. I think the idiot's gone after Bembe. Don't know how Bicho thinks he's going to track him down. Bicho always had her back. And we never... Just find the little shit. Okay? We're going to war. I need to rally our people. Train them. That means no one gets left behind, even Bicho. Good luck. At this stage, every guerrilla counts. Bicho, Bicho, you crazy come mierda. Where are you? He's not here. Maybe he left something lying around that will tell me where he went. Mm. So, Bembe is buying weapons from the military. Looks like the handoff was at the rodeo. Giving some Bavira off the top, huh? But hey, I should check that warehouse. If I find Bembe, I find Bicho. Be alive, mi socio. Oye, Palo. I think Bicho's done something stupid. What's he done this time? He's really going after Bembe. Stupid come mierda. Don't worry. I'll find him before he digs himself too deep. Hurry, Danny. Bicho's no match for someone like Bembe.
Bicho set the bulls loose on everyone. What a way to go. Looks like a deal that went bad. Real bad. Looks like one of them missed dogs didn't make it out. The little maniac sabotaged one of Bembe's black market deals. He let the bulls loose as some kind of rodeo. Repinga, he's going to get himself killed. I won't let anything happen to him. Again, that noise. Better watch myself. That's boom boom. God, don't kill me. Easy. Just tell me. A crazy kid come through here. Talks a lot. Hair kind of like a pineapple. Yeah. Came in here whiffing a gun around. Told me I had to tell him where my buyer lives. Guy called Bembe. Did you tell him? See? Si. And then the kid ran off. Can you tell me where Bembe lives? <sighs> Nobody knows exactly where his place is. But it's in Cruz del Salvador, near the border. That's all I know. I swear. Please, just let me go. Paolo, I know where to find Bembe. Then 
That's where Beecher will be. Exactly. Sit tight, Paolo. about this. Looks like Bembe hides out in an old slave shack on a plantation. That's Bicho's truck. Bicho! Bicho! Bicho, what the fuck? Get out of here, Danny! I'm gonna blow this cabron's head off! No, you're not. Oh, I'm not? You don't think I will? Eh? Bicho, listen to me. You thought coming here was going to fix it all. But it's not going according to plan, is it? What the fuck do you know, eh? I know you're no killer. And look at you shaking. You're a frightened little rat. A pest. A parasite. Yes. You take and give nothing back. Bicho, don't listen to him. That's right. Bicho, just a blood-sucking bug. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're not a bug, man. You're not Bicho. What's your real fucking name? You want to fix something? Pull that trigger. You need to shut the fuck up right now. My name's Paz. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You're Paz. Your name is Paz. You're not Bicho, man. You're not a bug. You're Paz. And I need you with us, okay? You're a piece of shit. At least I don't lie to my friends. Not that it matters. But I tried to get Palo out. I really did. Hey, Paolo. Danny, tell me Bicho's okay. Si. Talk to Marv doing something really stupid. He's a bit shook, but he's okay. Oh, fuck. Thank God. And Bebe? Still alive. Still a snake. Shit. I was hoping you wouldn't say that. There's always going to be a Bembe, Paolo. But there aren't many Bichos out there. When Bicho gets back... Maybe tell him how you feel, yeah? He could use it right now. I will. I promise. Thank you, Danny. Danny, how is my patient? Alive. Gracias. And I have another cool scar to show my friends. You joke, Danny. But it's the scars in your head that worry me most. Look, it's not a good situation here. Talia has an infection and we're low on medication. I'm sure Castillo has some to spare. You and I think alike. 
Hit these three checkpoints along the road west of my clinic. Hurry, Danny. Dahlia's life depends on it. Nobody told me this was a party. She's so quiet. See, si, big reunion. We need to hit El Doctor. You need to stay here. We need to move. We're not abandoning them. No. Massimas Mantanzas is Libertad. That footage from Castillo Zoo showed the cost of his paradise. The concert inspired thousands to join us. Radio Libertad inspires more. But you become a distraction. Maria's dead. Viviro is a new target. El Doctor is the key to fuck up Castillo's money machine. And he's in the Capitol. He's not there. My people have eyes on him. We were face to face. El Doctor is addicted to his work. He's not going anywhere. Matias has intel. Sergio Estevez, El Doctor's right-hand man, murdered hundreds with his medical trials. That's how we get El Doctor. <laughs> Weren't you running to America? Found your cojones a little late. I knew you were military. Paolo. You're right. I'm not your leader. But you've had one foot out the door now. Talia's committing executions. Revolution is chaos. But a leader creates their own order. Let's go. You're called Danny. Pedro Torrero. Now that was a fucking musician. Now that Mama and Papa are gone. We need Sergio. I'll find him. Then we pay El Doctor a visit. Boom, boom. house. Being a true Yarin pays off. Should check inside. Hey, it's Paolo. Just thought you should know what kind of monster Sergio is. Come and mierdas carried out thousands of fucked up experiments on outcasts. Even kids, Danny. It's fucking sick. And all of it just to make Bio Vida rich. Coño. I got to get this piece of shit. You will. Suerte. Adios, reinforcements. Smart dog. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Come mierda that's not here. Where did that fucker go? Should look around for clues. Good dog. Now, what do we have here?
you've been talking to, Serio? Serio, it's El Guerreras. The Guerreras are on to you. Come to me and we will provide the protection you need. Castillo can't afford to lose you, and neither can I. We have so many more trials to complete. Hijo de puta's been kicked off. Me cago en su madre. He's on the run. Oye, Matias. Someone warned El Doctor that we were coming. Said he was on the run. Pablo and I are on our way. Don't let that piece of shit escape. He's a fucking murderer. That true yard and piece of shit. Think you can run from me? You don't know who you're... Concussion, grade two or higher. Laceration, dislocated shoulder. Matias. Hey, Miguel, you're going to treat me to prove you're the better doctor. Where the fuck is El Doctor? The Vivero Processing Center, Building 13. What the fuck, Paolo? You think El Doctor could run the outcast camps without people like this piece of shit? None of this. None of this whole fucking mess would be happening without doctors like him. Fuck him. I'm all out of mercy. Insignificant trauma to the skull. Shit. at the lookout near the BioVida lab. We're going to hit a doctor where he lives. About fucking time. You and I are going to kill him, Danny. And we'll also hit Castillo where it hurts most. His fucking wallet. 
Well, look at that, Paolo. You made me smile. See you soon. <laughs>